You heard me. Uh, let's see. I tried that New York, and I just can't do it. Balanced offense? That might be me, though. I'm going to try this uh, running gun. That might work. I haven't done running gun in a few years, so run and shoot, maybe? I tried spread, but I don't have the receivers, you know, for spread, so I might have to do run and gun because I got ETN, so. And ETN's been doing nice, so I'm definitely going to have to. Damn, run balanced or run and gun? Run and shoot. Run and shoot? Run and gun. I might try run and gun. And then we want to kick. Right, CPU unis, all black. My helmet's icy. Let me just give them all black and then give them that alternate helmet. Yeah. Make them look icy. Car. Uh, yeah. Something like that. So they all black. Should we just go all white for the one time? Couple of shoes. I ain't trying to go all white. Fuck all that. Something like that. Let's go orange socks. Uh, yeah, let's just go white. Let's go white. Okay, advanced settings are set. Okay. Let's get it started. Ha! It's Madden NFL 24 on EA Sports. And coming up, we'll see Derek Carr. Solid performance a week ago, throwing for three touchdowns. Damn. It's the Saints and the Bisons under the lights on Thursday night. We got Devin Lloyd back. EA Sports coverage of the NFL has us in downtown New Orleans at the Caesars Superdome. Tonight we kick off week seven with a great Thursday night matchup here as it'll be the Bisons of San Antonio taking on the New Orleans Saints. Along with Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon, and Charles, you look at this Saints team as they interplay. They were winners last time out, so they'll be looking, Charles. We're still trying to find a win. And what I enjoyed when I watched their game tape and their victory last week is they've it's been, been four weeks. Every phase. Good offense, good defense, and some key plays on special teams. This young team's got to snap into it. Win in a row. Meanwhile, for our visiting San Antonio ball club, we're in October now, so everything, everybody should be coming into form, shouldn't they? they really we are in October. That's amazing. Is a full routine established about what you want to get done and full focus on the Boom. season. Getting toward the halfway Let's go, baby. Saheed. Smack that man up. Good tackle. Take it a yard or so past the 20, call it the 21. 
So here come the Saints to take over it's the first Derek game. Carr? The new man under center after nine seasons as a Raider. Yeah, wow, Derek that's nice. Is the guy. 11 and 2? That's not bad, dude. We got to exactly force turnovers now. Let's go by overall. They love throwing short, so that's what we're going to have to focus on here. God damn! My whole team's yellow. What is that? Ooh. My whole team goddamn yellow. Good tackle, Brown. Let's go, Sid. Officially a loss of two on the first play from scrimmage. Kamara's got a jukebox, so that's going to be a little dangerous. You're hoping that each of your guys gets those one on one blocks and creates a crease for your runner. Dog, this is crazy. You've got to win those one on one blocks, and when you don't, that's the result you end up with. So the opening play of the drive goes backwards. Now they'll come up on second and 12. From the gun, it's Carr. Oh my, why the fuck open? That's complete. It's Devin Duvernay. Duvernay. Dude, cover two never fucking works, bro. I mean, I wasn't able to call my play, but that shit is dead, bro. Never works. Never works. So the big play moves him all the way across midfield to the 40 now for first and 10. On play action. Now Carr. Good D. There we go. I think they still got Taysom Hill. I believe. If he was out there. Dude, I don't want fucking Drew Sanders right there, bro. They often ask the question, what's my motivation? But what's the motivation of this group? What's their mindset? What's the problem that they have? Will they create an identity that allows them to get better? Now Carr, after the incomplete pass, brings him up second and two. Alave and Thomas, bro. Looking to throw. There he is. There's Chris Alave. Ah, uh, yeah. I can't press, that's for sure. Reaching the 10 yard line. Give him 30 yards there. There's no doubt in my mind that not many guys in this league have had the impact that he's Good had route. in the first half of the season. He's been a big play guy from the word go and continues to be one with another one right there. Alave is a bad man. Okay, give me. Let me drew there. A terrific opening drive has them knocking on the door, first and goal. Again, they'll throw with Carr. Oh god damn. There's Dawson. They definitely still got Taysom, but I traded him Dawson. Jesus. Good ball. Good round. What you got, J-Mo? Come on, Quez. And here comes a return from the middle of the end zone. Oof, good move. Inside, probably should have taken a knee as he only gets this out to the 16-yard line. So out comes this offense to take over for the first time. They'll be let out by a man who took that huge jump everyone had hoped for in year two. One of the game's brightest young stars. And that's Trevor Lawrence. I love this quote during the week. If I were a defensive back, I would have wanted to play uh. last week as well. He's trying to eliminate those turnovers, those interceptions. All right, here we go, boys. Yeah, and four of those picks led to the loss. 
And here's a Louisiana native from the town of Jennings. It's Travis Etienne. Yeah, welcome home, Trev. Travis. I'm going to say that shit all season. Demario Davis there on the stop. This defense for the Saints, they were fantastic a week ago in that win over Houston. And as in any game, takeaways are always a big key. They're always discussed on defense. There's an emphasis there. And they came away with three interceptions in that game. Call it a gain of four there, so it sets up a big play here. Third and a yard. So they just need one yard here to pick up the first down. They'll run with ETN. Way to find the hold. That Werner? Yeah, they got Werner. That's nice. Yards, and that'll be enough. When you're dead last in the NFL in third down conversions, the odds are against you every time you face it. How about him picking up that one? That was big for them. They go play action with Lawrence. Ah! Holy shit. Expected. And I can see the officials kind of looking at each other down there, silently wondering, does this meet the level of grounding? Fortunately, he did have a receiver in the area, but I have seen less obvious throwaways called as penalties. Here you go, Rhaegar. And he gets this up across the 35 before Rager. I'm calling Rhaegar. I like Rhaegar. Ooh, speed up. A little speed up. Okay. God damn. Tyron. Losing yardage. It'll be back at the 36. That'll make it fourth down after a loss of one. Just a simple run play there on third and one, but this D was up to the challenge. Good pursuit. Bring it up fourth down. On fourth down, on is Logan Cook to punt. Deep for New Orleans is Rashid Shaheed. Only two punts for him last week in the loss as he gets this one away. It'll be a net of 40 yards there. Tackle Farley. 43 yard punt, three yard return. And the Saints will take over with a first down and 10. On first down, Carr. I'm going to stick with him, Sid. So it's incomplete. But you look at this defense against the pass, just numbers that they haven't liked. Number 30 in the league right now. And even though that's not the greatest ranking in the world, one thing you can say, they get after the quarterback. They're in the top 10 in the league in sacks. Card out of throw. Open man is Duvernay. Bro. And he's going to get this one across the 30-yard line. 10 yards, good for his Saints first down. Charles, Thursday night game, I think a lot of teams probably say shrink the playbook somewhat. Is that correct? I think you're right about that because you just don't have the amount of time that you have in a normal week to put in a full playbook. So as you said, you shrink the playbook, pick out the plays that work best for you. You know what else you're looking mm, for? Good catch, Knox. Precious guys coming off of the last game to play on a Thursday night. Guys have a little extra pep in their step. You go to them early and often. And CD, defensively, you're going against a hot quarterback coming off a three-touchdown game in their victory a week ago. What's the big key for them to try to slow him down? You ask all the tough questions, don't you, partner? Because with this guy, if you blitz him, he takes advantage of that man coverage and burns you. But if you bring on those extra DBs, he sits back there and does what he wants. Good tackle, Chase. It's going to be those DBs. When they Here we go, ball, baby. Big-time tackles really put it on those receivers. Step up, baby. Officially, it's a one-yard loss. That's going to bring up second and 11. That Need that. Well played there defensively. Two tight ends in the formation, which essentially gave them seven blockers up. Oh, he's hot, bet. It's hard to imagine with all that size and beef that they could let a tackler through. But that's exactly what happened. A loss resulted. Car to throw on second down. Good D. Uh-oh. 
Now a timeout here, at least for the moment. Looks like one of the Saints is injured. <laughs> Shit, Dawson got like six plays in. While they come out and take a look at him, we will step aside. Maybe ten. But he was involved in like six of them plays. Here is third and five. To throw his car. Good D. Good fucking D. Here we go, Campbell. Way to step up. Anytime he reads man coverage, I don't think it's going to be the only time he'll try to hit that route to the outside in this game. It's about to go out of bounds. But that time, they were up to the challenge. Ooh, good punt. Once in the victory last week as he sends this one away. Back onto the field comes this offense ready for their... Trev and Trev. Combination. Mired in a losing streak. Now they get the short week for the Thursday night game. Do you see that as a potential positive, or is this just more in what has been really a string of bad luck for them? Well, to me, it comes down to leadership, and leadership's got to spin it into a positive and make it an advantage for them. Yes, we're in a losing streak. Oh, my streak. God. Yes, no Trev, can you get it there? But we have the resources we need right here in this room. Dude, he... I felt like he was there. And shocked the world. Gotta get it to him, baby. Gotta get it to him. Let's go, Travis. Good run, baby. Good pull, Rinser. Good pull. Good speed, baby. Good speed. Marcus May. Saints got a solid defense, man. It's going to be hard. So the line of scrimmage moves all the way across the 50 now as they come up first and 10. Ah, shit. Good quarter. Good quarter. I was about to send it to uh, fucking Watkins deep. Second quarter now, San Antonio in possession as they've got it with a first and ten. Oh, oh, good run. Way to bounce off that. Dude, I was trying to throw that bubble route because I saw that corner come in. Come on, Quez. Way to get open, baby. He's going to go out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the 20. That one good for 26 and a first down. And this is where play Come on, let's get a drive going, fellas. Watch this block shed by DeMario. Oh, yeah, way to get up in there. DeMario's got like out my way, secure tackler. Maybe ETN be open right here, maybe. Oh yeah, I told you, <laughs> let's go baby, let's go. Good fucking pass. I put no look dead eye on uh, Trevor, so maybe that kind of helped on the accuracy a little bit. The sack race, yeah. And had Cameron Jordan in his face too. What a ball. What a ball. Good drive, fellas. Good drive. This run and gun looking real nice. It's up uh, I like the playbook so far. Seven here in quarter number two. A drive that time of six plays. And it was Travis Etienne on the touchdown reception capping the drive. I swear Etienne's like my leading receiver. So or in, in touchdowns at least, I think. Maybe him and Quez are tied. But I know Etienne's got like three receiving touchdowns. Oh. Oh. Good shit, Shahid. 
to the 27 yard line. How does the Saints offense now as they get ready to take over here? And they come off a victory over the weekend, but now the quick turnaround here for this Thursday night game. How does that affect how teams like this approach these short turnarounds? Well, wins and losses always factor into, you know, how you're getting ready for the next game. But equally as important when you have the short turnaround, what is your injury? What to stay on them? Are you losing key guys? And if so, how well have the backups prepared for this? Because you don't have much time to get them ready. They have to be ready before this week in order to play well in this game. Here's Carr to throw. Oh, shit! I'm right there, baby! Oh my god. Dude, that was just pure reaction. I didn't even think I'd get that. Oh my god. Let's go, Sydney. Good pick. Dude, that was a complete surprise to me. Good shit. That was just like 3-4 over, 4-3 over. Hold on, let me get a let me get a little pick. Let me get a little pick. Because I was supposed to be blitzing, but then I was, I was kind of like knocked off. So I was like, eh, that's a little late. And I saw the drag coming. So I was like, oh, he might throw it there. But he's going for fucking Taysom Hill. Dude, what a jump. What a fucking jump. Oh, my God. Keep making plays like that, Brown. You're going to be you're going to be real nice. Way to get up there. All five, ten of them. Like Palomalu with the hair. Start. Uh, uh. On first and ten, it's Lawrence. Got a man in Let's go, cunts. And he's gonna get this inside the thirty. They pick up twelve on the play, and the chains move. Way to get open, baby. And what a nice example there of a tight end doing exactly what he needs to do. How about how he worked his way to the outside, made sure he secured the catch. Palmer, can you get open, baby? After that, we count that as a bonus, and indeed, he gets enough for the first down. Ah, good D. There's a pass on first down that's knocked away. A Debo. Yes, sir. How about an out of boy there on first down, got his hand in and knocked it away. Now it's second and ten. Let's flip it here. Let's flip it. Oh, good broken tackle. They do get a couple, but they'll be left staring at a third and eight coming up. He's definitely tough to get down. We just saw it right there, but how about what we did see? Pursuit, wrap up, and then the big finish with the tackle. I can't motion him? Okay. On third down, Lawrence. Dude, how is that a pick, bro? How? Bro, ah, uh, dude, those fucking Texas routes. That's how I got picked off last time because they couldn't get off the cut, dude. Like, come on, bro. You serious, EA? Like, I can't even take control of my receiver and cut him off, too. Like, 2K, I'm going to need you to start making the next game. ASAP. Madden game is trash. Welcome back, Devin. I feel like I could see what he was thinking on that carry. Wanted to follow that big tackle through the hole. Ended up only getting four yards on the carry. I think he had designs on that one being bigger. Let's go! Papo! Welcome to the game, baby. My two linebackers. Welcome back, Devin. Good sack, boys. Damn good sack. And some secondary help here for the defense in the nickel on third and long. 
Car gonna throw. Yeah, good pressure. Good pressure, boys. Good D. Because they needed to come through with a completion there. Now a drive that started with great field position is facing fourth down. Dude, that's the second time we stopped them when they got past the 50, so that's good. Oh, good punt. 15 again? 60. Dude, that punter loves being inside the 15. All right, Trev. I don't think that was your fault last time. You'll be all right. Position Charles after throwing their first interception of the ball game. Yeah, and some guys, you know, they're gonna want to try and get a big play right away and take control back. Others, they're gonna want to look to hit a couple shorter passes and get a little momentum back that way. But for the defense, that goal's not changing a bit. They want another pick. You're exactly right about that. In fact, you gotta watch them a little bit because it's good run, play. Trev. They may cut down their gaps a little bit, maybe their splits a little bit in order to try and get to the ball even faster. To your minute. To your minute. Go, game. Coming up at halftime, I'll go for one personality. That's you, Charles Davis. To another one in Orlando, the coach. He'll have stats and scores from around the NFL. You and Jonathan Coachman both larger than life. No doubt about it. But you're stuck with me in this booth. <laughs> yes, and he's miles away and smiling. And happy. On second down, Lawrence. A short throw there to Strange. He's got his first catch here before halftime, and it goes for a first down. That was a route run not just with dexterity, but with intelligence. Found the hole in the zone, made sure the quarterback saw him, and was able to make the sure catch and put the down marker back to one. Good block. Good run, baby. I might call a timeout after this. They'll throw on first down with Lawrence. Flushed out right. Good block, ETN. Good block, baby. Way to get out of there, Trev. Maybe too good that time as he breaks away for 19 with his legs and a first down. Evident there that he learned his lesson from the last drive. Oh, wow. Bo was going across the field. That's all right. We still got a, about the same amount of yards. I'm so glad Trev has like a little bit of speed so that way he can scramble. Throwing now, Lawrence on first down. Ah, get out of there. Get, oh, my God. What the fuck? What the dog doing? Oh, here we go. You still got some gas in you, Trev. Good catch, Palmer. Good pass, Trev. Had to put that ball in there with a little extra zip, but he put it right where it needed to be. Yeah, that little extra zip on the pass. That required a little extra concentration for him, didn't it? Ball can get on you pretty quick in that manner, and he handled it well. Let me call timeout. Holy fuck. And now, before this first down play, we're going to get a timeout here. As it comes with 22 seconds to go here in half number one. Mm. Now Lawrence on first down. And that is him. Quez, come on, baby. coming at them because they're going towards traffic on that route as opposed to being away from it and maybe having a little bit more space. Lawrence going to throw again. Ah, good D. That's good D. 
incomplete. Oh, it would have been six points, but somehow he couldn't run it in. All right, Palmer. Let's see what you got, baby. Get out of there, Joshua. Oh! Damn. Good ball, Trev. And that could be one of those turning point plays in a ball game. A field goal gets you the lead here, but they want to make a statement and get six points. And they're certainly going to get that opportunity as they get the conversion. I'm just going to call a timeout to be safe. Perhaps a chance for one more quick play and then another timeout if they hurry. We'll see. Yeah, quick slants. You want it, Palmer? I think Trev. Oh, dude, that runs right there. That run is right there. Come on, baby. Wow, good fucking defense. That's all right. That's all right. timeout with three seconds left in the first half. I might. Hold on. Let me do that same shit. Hold on. Let me go here. Let me just flip it. So that way I got Sheriff on the strong side. No. I should just take him a fucking field goal. So a touchdown a piece. That's what we have to show at halftime is That's all right. It's all right. Seven, seven you got him next. As we'll get you over to Orlando where standing by is Jonathan Coachman. He has our EA Sports halftime report. All right, got the second half upon us sooner than we bargained for. Week 7, second half. Inside zone. I should have kicked the field goal cuz don't I get fucking don't I get ball? Welcome back I do get ball. Fuck. I should have known that. That's on me. Set and ready to go for the second half. One touchdown apiece. 7-7 seven, seven our score. Taking it about the one. Woo! Way to get up out of there, Quiz. This offense ready to go to begin this third quarter. Well, the first half, very even. I mean, really, in all facets, this ball game tied, Charles, so as we start the third quarter, curious Very to even matchup. Very yeah, even. I'm with you on that one, and we all know a lot of coaches from the NFL all the way down to the peewee level. They love to spin it to their teams. Hey, we're starting a brand new shorter ball game. It's all even. Let's go out and seize it. This is ours. On first down, Lawrence. Oh, fuck. Way to get rid of that. I'm surprised I wasn't a fumble. But the passing game right now for them, not overly impressive. Last week he hit on right at 50%. This week he's under 50%. And it's not just on him. Protection, a few breakdowns along the way. That's made him get off the spot. Receivers not getting their way over. Run, ETN. The coverage has been awfully tight. They've got to all get together and find ways to make this passing game get in gear. So much of the game today, we're looking for hybrid players. Guys who can do a combination of jobs. Combination. Strong safety position, not more than ever, is a hybrid type player. Half defensive back that covers passes, and half linebacker that makes tackles. We just saw the linebacker make that play. Ooh! Jedrick! Bro, that's the second time you got injured already. Here's Logan Cook now. God damn. His first punt, 45 yards. This looks good as well. Bro, I don't see no fair catch, EA. I'm going to kill him. I'm going to kill him. Strange shoulder. Dude, get in the game. Oh, shit. They flipping at the fucking line of scrimmage, boy. Throwing now is called. What? Oh, but but their guys can jump the fucking route and catch it, but mine can't. Okay. Line of scrimmage, the 28 now as they come up on second and a couple. Hey, what you got for me? Yeah, what you see in car? What you see in car? Let's go, Devin. 
Welcome back. Dude, it's almost like I have to send a blitz just to get pressure sometimes, dude. Absolutely going toe for toe. Just curious if one of these offenses can wake up a little bit. Is there any way they can find something that can pop something big to knock them back on their heels? Ah, good route. And he is going to have a Saints first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. You straight, Devin. That was my fault. I shouldn't have had you out there. Dog. There he is. There's the legend. A little five yard out route could get you 50 yards. Jesus. A broken tackle. Yeah. <laughs> Shit, Chase. He's going to be swallowed up right away. They'll wind up losing three. And now it's third down. Here we go. I got to I got to do this. You're expecting to see an empty space in front of you. But if not, well, things can go south in a hurry and that's exactly what we saw in that play with a loss. Throwing his car on third down. Dog, that better not be pass interference, dude. Or rough in the passer. I'll take it. So apparently some grabbing there in the middle of the O line. I've often wondered why that's third and seventeen for guys that play center. Having to snap the ball and then trying to get your hands into the proper position. That's difficult to do. He got caught that time. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Good knockdown, Stokes. I was not taking a chance on that pick. <laughs> Whether that's a little grabbing, a little hand fight. Better stick with him. Means necessary on third down. He was able to get the job done in the secondary and swat that one away. So Carr will exit stage right and on his Lutz for the Saints field goal. Good kick. See, I should have kicked my field goal, goddammit. It'll be my fault if we lose the game. Well, actually, pretty much every loss is my fault, but you know what I mean. <laughs> Let's go, Quez. Bail me out. I'll take it. I'll take it. And they'll get him down right around the 25, actually the 26 officially, so a net gain of one there. Hey, Lion, Lion! Now ETN to start the drive. Good double. Good double. Good gain of nine on first down. That was a good run, and it got to the second level. And what I mean by that is, that's where the linebackers usually play. First level being the defensive front, last level being the secondary. But the good double off. Good double off, Sheriff. And oftentimes we call them a hybrid combination defensive back, combination linebacker. We saw the linebacker make the stop. So here's a first and ten at the 38. Another good double, Jaderic. Good tackle, Tyron. Come on. Get shysty then. Oh, please. Can this counter work? Ugh. Dude, of course, because I ran with him like five times. Well, now they're going to come out and take a look at this injury, and we'll be back in a moment. So from just across the midfield stripe, here's second and nine. 
Lawrence now off the bootleg, sliding out of the pocket. God damn, good D, May. Joshua. High ankle sprain. Jesus. It's like Knox ain't coming back. Way to get in there, Chase. Good shit, baby. Not many guys who can blow up plays like Chase Young. He did it again there. Big foe. Big foe. Oh, Biotis is the center. One quarter remains here in this Thursday night matchup. You are watching the NFL. Back now here live in New Orleans. It's been a very hotly contested game to this point. Just a field goal separating these two teams as we get set for the fourth quarter. Kamara gets it again on second. Dog. Oh, my God. Because Chase Young's not going to make that tackle. Jesus. That's crazy. And he catching that with double contact? I guess that's Michael Thomas for you. Let's go, Stokes! Come on, baby! Thank you! I know you wanted to jump that other one. Way to step up, Stokes. What a fucking catch, baby. Turning it over. Now the door is open for the opposition. Just in general, when you're passing in the fourth quarter with a lead, no matter what point, you gotta be super Good pressure, Devin. Alright, Bixby. Let's go, Rook. Let's see what you got. Oh, let's get a little, little instant replay. Hold up. Had the good pressure. Couldn't get the ball right there. Beautiful dive, baby. Beautiful dive. Yeah, Stokes might have a little, little home here in San Antonio, or at least with the franchise. Maybe not in San Antonio, but with this franchise for sure. They need to try to at least get three. Obviously, a touchdown puts them Good block. In a Great block. First down run as he gets his forward for about eight or nine. That looks to be eight officially. So 26 counter, 26 counter on one-on-one. -on -one. Ready? Can I flip it? No, okay, no, I can't. Good block. That's a first. Good block. Not too many more ideal situations in second and two in order to try and pick up a first down. They ran it and picked it up. 
Come on, Bixby, let's show up. Teams working on short rest, but this has been one of the better Thursday night games we've seen as they come up here on first and ten. Oh, great block. Great block. Way to break that tackle, Bixby. And result of that one, a nice four-yard gain. So you can use that to set up your play action game. Or you can come right back and continue to run the football. Come on, let's go at those DBs. Come on. Just gotta get a block on Cam. Actually, let's just get a dive. Let's get a dive. You're not gonna get injured on me, are you, Bigsby? Second down is a run with Bigsby. Thank you, Sher, for pushing. That's why I run behind you, so you can push me if I get in front. Yeah, they really needed to get something going, didn't they? They had punted on the last two possessions. The running game starting to come to the front for them. Yeah, it is. Yeah, nice five down. They got DeMario on somebody. And now they'll throw it with Lawrence. Oh, wide open! Let's go, Palmer! Get there! Yeah! Woo! I know some funky shit was going on. Hey. Uh, 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 uh. Quick feet. Quick feet. Quick feet. And so hard to adjust because I don't know what happened, but I'm glad it did. Beat in the middle of the field, and that's how they move you first before they break off to the corner. But then it's a wide receiver. Great job. It's tough to turn those upfield and go, but he did a great job with it there. Absolutely. Good pass, Trev. Hold on, let's take a look at that real quick. Let's take a look real quick, real quick. So I saw five down. I was like, okay, I have this formation. I was like, they they got. A linebacker on two receivers, so I'm wondering, is like a zone, or it's like he's manned up on somebody. I don't even know what I don't even know what that is. What are they doing, dude? Palmer fucking got they ass. Mm. I mean, OJ was wide the fuck. Oh, it was man. Was it man? Some I don't know, but OJ was open. Looked like cover cover three, cover one, spy, something like that. But I'll take it. Way to get in the end zone, Palmer. Body control, and how about the end result? A touchdown. Good drive, fellas. That's what we needed after what two, two, three and outs. Last two drives. Whew. Good shit. All right, now we just gotta play more D. That's. You know, I, I got faith in y'all. Joey slide out Let it fly, baby. Boop. And good runs, Bixby. That's what I needed from you. From his end zone, here's Rashid Bro, I'm not punching that bitch out. EA, come on, dog. The ball's just hanging out there, dude. Car going to lead the Saints up here first and 10 at their own 20 yard line. Trying to shake off the interception from the last. Ooh, game. way to stick with him. Way to stick with him. You all right? That play going for 16 yards to start the drive first down. Tell you what, he's been able to put the ball in some tight spots. You all right, baby. You all right. Yeah, a lot of people call it a gutsy type of a throw. I think he looks at it as I can do it. So it's not that big of a deal to me. I'm going to keep firing. Ooh, good tackle, Brown. Way to get there. Ooh, way to get there, Johnson. Come on, get rowdy on him. Get rowdy on him. Come on, get hyped, boy. Get hyped. I think you're really on to something there in this passing game. It just can't get off the ground. And that play, it wound up losing yardage. Ooh. Ooh. Two minute. Two minute. Fuck. We got three wide. 
They face a critical third down now, needing a score here in the late going. They'll come to the line, needing only two yards to gain the first here. Carr looking to throw on third and two. Let's go, Stokes! Come on, baby! I told you, you are all right. Just give me something else. Dude, Stokes better get a fucking dev soon. This man's been performing. Oh, they want to go for it? They want to. They want to go? Another big play in a game that's had plenty of them. Fourth and two. Now Carr gotta have this one. Bro, what? Their third string tight end? Good play. Good play. I knew it was going to be a short. A little short pass. Good play. What we got? Damn. You want me to cover the whole fucking field? Oh, shit. All three timeouts still remain. Here's first and ten now. Now Carr. Get to that man. Get to that man. Get to that man. Get to that man. Come on, Chase. Come on, Chase. Let's go, baby. Come on, Chase. Way to work. Way to work. Play at this point in the game. Car to throw. Oh, look at Thomas. Woo! Way to get there, Papo. Way to get there. As they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds left to go in the game. What a kickoff to the week this has been. Now a big play. It's third down. Car. No, sir. No, sir. No, sir. Let's go. Good D. Good D. I knew the stick route was coming. Fucking defense, boys. Whoa, wide open. Oh, he dropped the ball. He dropped the ball. Oh my god. He wasn't ready. Oh, that's how they lost the game right there. They got two timeouts. Wow. Wow. Feel like Thomas O'Malley, goddamn. Dude, wide the fuck open, bro. Cover three. I don't know what the fuck fart like, bro. You're in a cover three, bro. Go back there. Like, I, I got a purple over there for a reason, EA. Like, what are you trying to do to me? Like, I had the I had a middle all covered, and all I needed was Farley up there, bro. EA could have just fucked me right there. Dude, that's insane. Right in the hands, bro. And then he stumbled, too. Like, what is EA doing, bro? Like he just got fucking hit or something. <laughs> what is that shit, bro? What is this? Whoever just joined, look at this shit. Wide open to win to win the game, pretty much, or at least get in, you know, field goal position or you know, another first down. But bro, wide open. Oh man. What a bonehead play. You're... Good run, Bixby. I'm glad I could count on you, baby. Wow, what a crazy game. He's going to get it again. Let's go, Bixby. Get you some yards, baby. Way to close it out. Way to come in and, you know, take over for ETN. Way to take over, Bixby. Good blocks, fellas. Good blocks. Yeah, run and gun might be the, might be the playbook right here. Another run by Bixby. 
Get out of there, Bixby. OJ. It's all right. I got four tight ends. Hold on here because on that last run, it looks like we have a player who was shaken up. Good blocks. Come out here and take a look, and we will take a short break. So the ball down to the 16 here for first and 10. From the gun, big speed. Woo, way to hold on to it. Torn labrum. We got Latavius in. Everyone was in the right place. Now a handoff to Bigsby. And he'll be taken down. Here. Good game, fellas. Way to come back. Way to rally. Oh my. We definitely won that game because I didn't throw four picks this time. And we had over like 150 rushing, so. Good D. And that was probably some of the best defense we played so far. And dominance is starting to take over, right? The way that you close, the way that you finish, that gets preached to you from the time you're playing Little League football all the way up through. And they closed them out with a big Crazy. down the stretch. So for San Antonio, they fall a game under 500 now at three up and four down. Look at Chase work. Days to get ready for next week where they take on the Pittsburgh Steelers. Meanwhile, for the Saints, they fall a game under the 500 mark at three and four through seven games. And they'll try to get back to their winning ways next week as they head to Indianapolis to take on the Colts. Absolutely. I'm Brandon Gordon, certainly have to thank Dude, Charles Chase Podcast on a three-man rush. Crew, on a three-man rush. Right here, it's the NFL on EA Sports. We're double teamed, bro. Oh my god, fucking. Oh man, Chase definitely showed up this game. I will say that. Chase showed the fuck up. Good fucking game, boys. Great game. We needed that win. We really did. Let's try and get these last two wins before the bye week, you know? So OJ's out for a couple weeks. Okay. At least OJ's out and not fucking ETN, so I'll take that. Good work, OJ. I'll see you in four weeks. But yeah. Uh you know, we've been working on defense a little bit. You know, uh, last week led up 31. Two weeks before that led up like 42 or something like that, 45. And now this week we've only led up 10. So, you know, defense is coming into form. We just got to get the offense rolling a little bit. And, you know, I think I kind of finally found a little playbook that, that's real nice, like, for how my team set up. So, run and gun might be the, might be the playbook. So, all right. So, uh, until – oh, look, and we got all the goals too, like – that's a first. We got most of them. Or all of them, I guess, pretty much, yeah. So, yeah, we had a good week, you know. So, on, on to the next. Steelers going to be, you know, uh, pretty pretty solid defensive-wise. And uh, offensively, we just got to contain those receivers and uh, Najee Harris. And, you know, we just got to get to Kenny Pickett. So, until next time, I'll see you all later. Be safe out there.